So this is my Trustmaster 458 uh, gas and brake pedals. And I find they're too stiff. Mainly the brake is just so stiff. Just decided to open to see what's in there. And I realized that the brake side has bigger coil springs. If you look carefully, the gauge of these springs is smaller on the gas side than on the brake side. And there's a pretty big preload on it. Means when you open the box, uh, the pedals want to push backward because when you assemble it, you preload the spring. So I want to get rid of some of the preload. So uh, I was trying to figure how to, um, you know, because you, you can't separate both uh, parts because the top of the pedals is a bigger piece of plastic. So the only way you can do that is by um, removing the big pins that hold all this together. So you see there's like a bigger side on the left here and the smaller side on the right. So... Uh, let me just try to push with my screwdriver here, see I can pull this pin out, let me just try this, oh yeah, you see this pin is just walking right out, and it's greasy and everything, so I'm, uh... okay, so now that I pulled out this pin, yeah, it's all coming off, so let's do the right one. Um, do I really want to do the right one too? I'm going to start working on those springs. I'm going to try to, um, you know, you know the way they're bent, you know, uh, these are quite difficult to bend. You, you're going to need a really good pair of pliers, but I'm going to try to uh, put a little bend in them so or maybe just reassemble the thing with only one instead of two springs. I think that would mellow out the, my brake pedal a whole lot. Let me try that right now. All right, so I'm dropping back this pin in with only one spring. Can't wait to see how this bad brake pedal is going to behave now. Yeah, it's going to be much easier, much easier. So I can tell uh, it's going to be much easier to reassemble now because the preload I was talking about makes it that the the pedal, the, the, the both parts are difficult to bring back together because the, the pedals, uh, you need to push them down to, to be able to bring both sides, both sides of the cover together. But... Yeah, give me a second. So I realized the only way to reassemble this now, um, unless you have a second person holding down the pedals, the only way to reassemble it is to just put the bottom screws on only halfway in so that they don't put too much pressure, but just to hold the whole thing down while you uh, press it down and put, put in the other screws. If, if you have a, just the bottom screws first in, then it, it sort of holds the bottom to, to, to keep uh, assembling it. So yeah, this brake pedal is just perfect, 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 perfect. I, I think I'm going to do the same to the gas pedal. I just, just excuse my white socks. <laughs> yeah, I'll just put my whole crops on there. So yeah. Now, um, so now, yeah, the brake is, it's like a real car. Look, I'm 40 years old. I've been driving for like 25 years. Uh, yeah, th this is much more like a real car. I think I'm going to put just one spring on the gas too. The brake is much easier now. Much, much, much. It's perfect. One spring. 